I'm the Pony Commission. Hey, what's poppin' everybody? It's, uh, it's Jack Moe, man. The guru of giddy up. But you can also call me your... <coughs> your pony commissioner. And, uh, check this out, right? I already found a video tonight, man. I really wasn't planning on doing another video. But, uh, go check out the Corporate Slave Finals or Championship Round. It's on Black Bond Channel, man. But, speaking of Corporate Slaves, right? This is the reason I'm doing this video. Now, a lot of people tend to say, Jack Moe. How can you, you know, call out corporate slaves when you yourself is an admitted fanboy? You call yourself the Pony Commissioner. Now, these are the same people that try to insult me calling myself the Pony Commissioner, saying I'm a fanboy. But I call myself the Pony Commissioner. See, look, y'all the same type of dudes that gotta wear helmets when y'all take a bath, man. And them little fucking water wings on your arms. Y'all niggas is retarded. Y'all know that. Listen, man. There's a distinct difference between a fanboy and a corporate slave. And I'm finna lay it out to you, right? Uh, things that a corporate slave would do. They, they usually lie and say things that can be easily disproven. And they say it as fact. They say things like, say for instance, right? We got a guy in the community. He has two achievements in Tomb Raider for the Xbox One. But he said it's his game of the year. That's corporate slave shit. How is that your game of the year when you ain't played it? You know what I mean? People who say shit like, okay, so you Sony fans don't buy your games, right? But then you turn around and look at him, and he's only purchased two games for his console of choice, and one of those was from a third-party seller. So he don't even do what he talking about. You see what I'm saying? I'm a fanboy. I admit that. I take pride in that. But do this right. If you want to criticize me, name a game that I praise that I didn't buy or that I didn't beat. You can't do it, bro. Stop it, all right? Any game that I recommend, any game that I tell y'all to play, you best believe I didn't already play that motherfucker. You best believe I didn't already beat that motherfucker. And I probably got the platinum in that motherfucker, all right? Like I said, it's going to be a quick video because it shouldn't even have to be explained. There's a difference between corporate slave and fanboy. You can be a fanboy and not lie about something, all right? BG. BG a SOCOM fanboy. He ain't never lied about the series. Him being a fanboy is him talking about the games, liking the games. Now, if he was to come on YouTube and say that SOCOM 4 was the best game of last gen and that it rated higher than every other game and that it outsold every other game the month it came out, that would be some corporate slave type shit. You see what I'm saying? There's a difference. I ain't never lied on my channel. If I misspoke about something, I've always corrected myself. Y'all know that about me, man. There's no fraudulence going on around here. So, with that being said, man, this is Jack Moore, your pony commissioner, the proud Sony fanboy that I am. Then, you know, the guy that buy, play, and beat the games that I recommend? Yeah, I do that. I ain't on here over no pyro shit. Pyro recommend games that he won't touch, that he buy and don't play. You know, I drop names, Zobi. He's a fraud. He said that the Rise of Tomb Raider has outsold every PlayStation 4 exclusive. That's not true. Corporate slave shit, man. That's corporate slave shit, people. Y'all know the difference. I shouldn't be having to explain it to y'all, all right? Anyway, man, this was Jack Moo. Thank y'all for rocking out with me, man. But I'm signing out, though. Stop the fuckery. Stop the ignorance, all right? Peace. Feel that shit. They talk that shit, but I live that shit. Gotta copyright the flow, cause they steal that shit. Well, you know it damn well, you ain't did that shit. Serving that white in the trench. Watch for the cops and the snitch. I was trapping them out of my business. I'm trapping them, I'm tapping them fists. Niggas get jealous like pits. I'm feeling like all of you niggas, my children. They know that all of my clips is extended. Trust me, and all of you niggas can get it. Give a fuck what you heard. All that sneak this and gonna get some niggas murked. Niggas spread rooms, but that shit won't work.